not receiving Apple ID verification text or the 6-digit two-factor authentication code on your iPhone 17, 17 Pro or Pro Max, or it's showing an error that says verification codes can't be sent to this phone number, here's how easily you can get past this error and log in to your Apple ID. The first step will be restarting both your iPhone 17 and the device that you're gonna get the code on. To perform a forced restart, press the volume up, then quickly the volume down, and then hold down the side button until your iPhone screen turns off and the Apple logo appears. And to receive the verification code pop-up on another Apple device, you'll need to make sure both the devices are connected to a stable Wi-Fi or internet. If you're not getting the pop-up using a Wi-Fi, then you can also try changing the network or using cellular data. Now, in case you don't have another Apple device or the Apple ID verification pop-up isn't working, then you can use an alternate two-factor authentication method. So when you get this pop-up, you'll just need to tap on didn't get a code, select can't get to device, then it will give you the option to send the code to your phone number that's connected to your Apple ID. And in your case, if you're having trouble with SMS, then just select get a phone call. So now you'll be able to bypass the SMS error and get your code via phone call. In your case, if you're still not getting any phone call or SMS either, then you can also choose can't use this number and start account recovery. After that, you'll get contacted by an Apple agent and this may take a day or two. Before this, you can also try some other workarounds or troubleshooting. For example, if you have another Apple device, then you can use the use another Apple device feature then after unlocking your other device, you'll get this sign-in pop-up and sign in to your Apple ID without needing any code, simply by scanning the pattern. And in case you're still not getting an SMS on your phone number, then the problem may be with your carrier. So you have two options. The first one is updating your phone number to a different one. And if you have another Apple device, then you can change it right from the settings. Just open settings on your other device, tap on your name or profile, sign-in and security, and choose add email or phone number. Now you can tap on the phone number and enter a phone number ideally from a different carrier. But if you don't have a device, then don't worry. You just need to open the browser and go to accounts.apple.com. Now tap on sign in and here you'll be able to sign in using your face ID or passcode. So no need for any authentication code. And after that, just tap on email or phone number and add a new phone number where you can get the SMS. But if you don't want to add a different phone number and get it fixed, then you should get in touch with your carrier as soon as possible and get it sorted. But in case, if it's an Apple device that's not showing the authentication pop-up, then in that case, get in touch with Apple support using the Apple support app. And that's all. Let us know your feedback and I'll see you around.